Yo! So, I'm not sure if you knew this, but over the last few days... Mother Nature has, well, she's been out in full force and brought with her a shed load of water. Now, about 10 minutes drive from here, there's a ford, which is pretty much where water crosses over a road. And recently... <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it got me thinking. Will the Defender go through it? This is a really, really stupid idea. Okay, so I am, I am literally two minutes away and I have passed three signs that say road closed. It should be a red flag going up saying, Alex, don't try this. But I'm still gonna send it. <laughs> Let's raise this puppy up a little bit. There's literally people videoing. Look, look at these people here all videoing. This is unreal. Right, let's go through slowly. Oh, this is easy. This is really, really easy. Okay, we can do this faster. Is it clear? Absolutely awesome piece of kit. I've lost a bit of trim off the car and they're trying to get it back. What absolute legends. Have you got it? Try and chuck it in there, mate. Ready? Yeah, go on. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. Oh, he's putting it back on for me. Make sure they lined up, mate. Just smack it in, mate. Again. That was so worth it. However, I have sustained a slight bit of damage to the Defender on both sides. So this bit here is a little bit loose, as you can see. And then my trim on this side has, uh, yeah, we're missing a clip. I think one of the clips is broken off, but she survived. Whoa. Sick. No way. Hello, testing. Hello, testing. Can you still hear me? Can you still hear me? I'm all the way over here. Look, I'm over here. Okay, so all of you lot should have heard of the uh, the company Joby, right? They make a... Uh, wait a minute. The Gorilla Pod, which I'm currently using on my camera. This thing has been a huge help for my entire career. Now, it was always gonna be sort of a matter of time before Joby got into, well, let's just say the rest of the creator space other than Gorilla Pods. Check this out, a shotgun microphone that has active noise reduction. What? They've made this little wireless lav system, like a lavalier microphone system. Look at the size of my old system. That's just one of the receivers. What? They've also made this as well, the Wavo Pod, a USB condenser mic for the computer. Well, it's safe to say, welcome Joby to the audio game. Right, Alex is trying to cut something up, okay, I'm gonna try and scare him a little bit. Alex! Hey! Got sawdust in my eye. <laughs> yeah, I've got sawdust in you. Yeah, I've actually got sawdust in both my eyes. Because I've been editing these vlogs now for a while and I still don't understand the concept of Mars Bar Weekly. <laughs> Mars Bar Weekly is just a series of random things that I get up to in any given week and if I think it's good it goes into a Mars Bar Weekly meaning that this is a video with absolutely no structure whatsoever. Weekly Dotted moments, around. yeah. Dotted around, scattered around in one unique format. Now I know there's going to be so many questions about what's actually going on behind me in the office and I'm going to answer them all in this video but first I'm already late to go and see my friend Jimmy because well he needs the setup doctor Alex to come and see him. <laughs> So I've almost arrived at Jimmy's. I wanted to answer a few questions whilst I'm in the Tesla. First off, Alex, do you like it? 100% yes. The only issues is with it is you have to charge it a lot. Like obviously, duh, I get that. But when it's like parked on the driveway and you're not even driving it, it still loses battery. However, this entire drive here has been a complete breeze. I've barely had to even touch the steering wheel. We were almost at Jimmy's. Hello, mate. Hello, How you doing? Jimmy! You not seen the Tesla? I like it without the wheel thing. What, what do, you, do you rate it? Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy's set up. Check it out. It's not budget. It is budget. You got a dual monitors, bro. Okay, so Jimmy, this right. is uh, this is the setup, is it not? Holy hell, that's a wide lens. It is very, uh, very yeah. wide. I've just moved 
back home. Just moved back home and, and this is my shit setup. And you don't know how to cable manage, do you, clearly? What do you mean? <laughs> Look at that! I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure if we dismantle this whole thing and then redo it, we can just make it loads better. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Let's send it. You? So Jimmy has this huge cable here which comes out the cupboard for his internet. Um This is unreal, mate. <laughs> I'm sure, this is why I've come down here today. 100 miles, mate. I'm sure we can make this sick. Oh! <laughs> One of Jimmy's main goals is he wants to start streaming on Twitch, so he's gonna need a place to mount his camera. Jimmy, do you stream with this thing? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that is huge. So Jimmy uses this to, to stream with on Twitch, which is absolutely mental. Hashtag 2022 glow up. That goes on there. So we're currently trying to figure out is we had two monitor arms oh, for before. Sake. It oh, will work, it will work. Damn it! Everything is plugged in. Oh, okay. Realise that I've plugged everything into his setup. He still thinks it's like <laughs> just set up without cables. Everything's plugged in and cable managed right now, so it's better than it was before. So I may have just got rid of the huge cable that's in the hallway. What were you getting before? Just more than that. More than that. Only just though. So we've got a little Wi-Fi disc here, which is sort of getting rid of the cable that we had going across the hallway before. Okay, we're getting there, but it would not be a Mars bar setup if we didn't include one of these. So this can live at the back of these monitors and then we're pretty much good to go. Bro, it's looking, looking like a lot sleeker than it was before. That's finishing touch. Ethernet cable in, LED strip on. The setup doctor has been, he's seen and he's most definitely conquered. And thus, we can confirm OBS is all working. Look at that, there we are. Sweet. <laughs> Insane, what is going on? Here is this, Jimmy. 1977. 1977. Listen to the sound of that. Are you a happy little chappy? Yes. <laughs> That's a bit of polish, though. It's insane. Yeah, it needs a bit of a polish, but once it is polished, it's going to look absolutely <laughs> top dog. What an absolutely awesome machine. Very cool. Okay, so really awesome to see Jimmy. And I just want to say that was my first proper road trip in the Tesla. I actually kind of enjoyed it. Had to supercharge for about 15 minutes, which gave me 100 miles. Anyway, we have a vlog about the Tesla versus my old car, the M2, coming up very shortly. So get subscribed for that. But first, what's going on with the office? Because as you can see, we're dealing with a very unlevel floor. Yeah. So believe it or not, this piece of wood, right, is completely level. We've got this much of a gap here, but that side, it's a little bit bigger. So we're currently leveling off the floor of this section in the office. We've put this sort of thing on the wall, which is gonna have a neon sign in front of it. Now I'll play a bit of a guessing game with you guys. Let me know in the comments. What am I actually doing with this? And I'll give you a clue. Starts with P and ends in T. <laughs> But yeah, that's it for this episode of Mars Bowl Weekly. Don't expect a Mars Bowl Weekly next week because I can guarantee there won't be one. But there'll be one when I've next got some cool stuff to show you guys. But anyway, my name's been Alex and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.